Hello and welcome to Magsy's Fun Time. This is Magsy, and we are back here on regular Minecraft 1.8. I think it's point three now. Um, I'm still working on my roof. Uh, I wanted it to, to feel like a really large roof or house, so I did kind of like a little thing on the outside here, and so I put steps up there. I might put a little like a uh, upside down stair thing right here I ain't decided yet I extended this out to here just so we have access to the roof up here and uh, I'm, I'm I'm doing class right now to fill in that part so so that'll be working right now um I want to go exploring today so we're gonna make a map real quick I did go ahead and make another compass just so I could find my way back home <laughs> um, but we do want to make a map too, so uh, uh, we are going to do that. I'm just going to turn all this I possibly can into paper. And I need four pieces of iron and another piece of redstone. Now, how you make a compass is you put a redstone in the middle and then iron on the outside. Now if you wanted a daylight sensor replace the iron with gold. So there's that. And then you take the compass put it in the middle and then surround it by paper. And then that will give you an empty map. And then you put the empty map in your inventory and you right click on it and it will show you the area of your hand. And look wonderful 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 <laughs> Uh, we're out in the middle of the ocean, so it doesn't show much. Um, you can expand this map, though. If you put the map back in here and you surround it again by paper, it will expand it out a little further. And then you right-click on it again. And uh, the circle is as far out as you can see, okay? So uh, we're going to take this over there. And, uh, and as we're going, we can uh, open this up in our inventory and as as long as you have it opened up in your inventory it'll show you what's over there so that's the way that works and and you can keep expanding this uh, I don't know what the maximum limit is you can check the wiki out to see what the maximum limit. that's as much as we can do right now because I just now got the um, sugarcane home <laughs> um, uh, two, we are actually going to go downstairs and we're going to use some cobblestone and a crafting table to actually make a uh, smelting area in our mines. So I thought that would be pretty cool. We also need to get a door up here at some point. So uh, I guess this here would be a really good place. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, we might need two crafting grids just to make it look symmetrical. But uh, for now, this one will do. And we'll pop this sucker in right here. And then we're going to take these and the eventual plan is to fill up this whole entire wall. But I will start with the bottom row here. And uh, eventually this whole wall here will be full. Yeah. Actually, we could... We could reduce this by one here. And then take this out. then place it here and that will be symmetrical and we won't have to put two crafting grids down there we go and uh, we'll just stick uh, some of this in here and let's see that should be fine for now put eight pieces in each one Two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
And I'm going to put that 6 in there. And I'll go mining for some more um, coal later. Just for right now. And in this one, I want to do some more um, glass. There we go. Um, hold on, guys. We're getting a phone call. I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. I think I might have some more cobble upstairs. Let's go see about that. Also, I want to wait till nighttime to actually travel over or uh, before we travel over there because I want to have a full day of exploration. I don't know if I'll do that all on camera. Yes, I did have a little bit more cobble. There we go. So we, I'd like to go ahead and get this fully set up. I hate leaving things half done. So, uh, we, uh, get eight more of these made. And, uh, if I have to, I'll cut down a bunch of trees and, uh, we'll get, uh, Perfect. And I'll cut down a bunch of trees. We'll get some chests down here. And uh, I'll do some charcoal and we'll get all these filled up until we can get more um, coal. Uh, for right now, I want to get glass made. Um, I don't know how much I'm going to need, so I'm just going to stick a bunch of this in here. Um, don't ask. And if nothing else, we'll get a little bit of experience out of this. There we go. That should be plenty. I'm going to stick the rest of this into the uh, thing. We'll probably go cut some trees down. I got I got wood over here, but I want to go ahead and gather supplies for the project. So I'll probably go ahead and stack, cut down a stack of uh, birch just to, to make chest out of. That should do it. Put all of this in here. I'm gonna go plant this. There we go. It'd probably be better to go ahead and grab the uh, the growth off of this anyway. There we go. Okay, so off camera, I did do some work over here. Um, I am still working on the supplies for the enchanting table, so <laughs> it will take some time. Uh, I'm going to do something in here. I don't know, maybe some secret fields. I ain't, I ain't really decided. I did build it down like this. Um, I'm going to try to clear this out. We might dig this down three. What is the... 6 yeah, we might dig this down three and see if we can get some squid to spawn it in here. That way we have a steady supply of our own. And it's getting nighttime, which is perfect. Perfect. And we should have glass in here. So let's go up there and uh, put this glass in. There we go. Every one of my builds, I usually do a sunroof. It's kind of weird. Um, actually, I might... Let's take these corners out. I know that's wasting glass, but uh, I was kind of wanting to do maybe the corners again. Out of the brick. Like that. And then we'll just drop in here. <laughs> We'll just cheat and drop in the top. Um, I thought I had some brick. Two, three. We'll just mix them. There we go. And then we'll go outside again. <laughs> that should have been the last time we have to drop off like that. There we go. Yeah, I like that. Non-square. 
There we go. These up. And I'm going to sleep. And then I will see you guys over on the island. Okay, guys, I'm back. And we are... Oh, it broke. Yeah, see, my boat was there. Register in there, but we were actually way back here. So, <laughs> love boat mechanics. Um, I think this thing might actually be far enough away from um our. Uh, we are way over here, which is weird. Which means this map isn't even on our list. It's weird. Is there a glitch with the maps on 1.8? Okay, that's going south. So, in order for us to use this map reliably, yeah, we'll have to go that way. <laughs> Which means we're going to have to make this map much bigger. Or make a new map and bring it over here. Might be a better bet. Since this looks like it's in a different chunk, that might be easier. So, that map's useless. Let's go ahead and put it out of our inventory. No point having it. We're going to cut down some of these trees. I at least have a compass with me so I can actually get back. Our spawn is actually over there. Now, if you build away from spawn, the compass is not really going to help you that much. Depending on how far away from spawn you're at. Because it only shows you where your actual spawn point is. So it only leads you back to spawn. It doesn't actually lead you to your bed. So. And the difference is, uh, if you open yourself to land, uh, the regular players will spawn at spawn. They won't spawn at your bed. Yeah, that's why. I wish there was a way to set, maybe set one to your bed your house or something that would be pretty cool some some little thing to add in um, we're gonna make some chests so we need a lot of wood and then we're gonna do a little bit more exploring at the end off the episode and then by the next episode I should have some chests set up down there now I don't have string so I don't think I can make the trap chest so we might just do double chest or we might just leave a space in between each one and just put one chest I don't know how I decided. If we're going to do that, I might need two stacks of wood. So. I hope everybody's doing alright today. I should say that at the beginning of the episode, and I always forget. <laughs> um, uh, I might cut back on this series to two days a week and do some uh, Dire Wolf stuff on Wednesdays. Probably starting next week. Um, I've done some uh, off-camera recording just to see if it is uh, going to allow us to actually do that. And uh, things are looking good. I think if I take Wella out, then we should be good to play on Direwolf again. Um, he's changed Direwolf some. Um, I was using the crops. And the last time I played with my kids was on Dire Wolf, the new pack, and the crops wasn't in there, so I don't know if something happened to my. I don't know if something happened to mine, or he just um, took crops out. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Kind of weird. Um. I think it was part of IC2 originally, but also there's another mod that uses those crops now, so uh, I don't know. Don't know. How many we got? Oh, two stacks, that should be plenty. And I think I got more um, things. I think we'll go over here and try to get these pumpkins. So guys, if you like this episode and you want to show me you like the episode, go ahead and smack that like button. 
if you subscribe to my channel I'll send you notifications when I have new videos out you can come check them out send it with if you like them if you do like this episode you want to share it with your friends tell me how much you liked it there's a share tab down below click on share tab copy the link post it in Facebook Twitter wherever you do social media also if you guys want you can donate to my channel to help me out and that link is on my main channel page just click on it you do have to have a Google wallet account so just be mindful of that and I will see you guys on the next episode